Hi guys, so today I'm just going to be doing a haul video, and earlier tonight I went to Ulta and Target, so Ulta and Target, and I'm actually just going to, my Target bag's over there, so that's why I didn't show it. I'm just going to do things kind of like by like brand, and not by like which store I got them at. So I'm going to start with the L Studio line, and first thing I got was the brush. And the Elf Studio line is everything's three dollars in it, which is like an amazing deal. And I got the eyeshadow C brush. See, it's shaped like a C. It smells really good, but it doesn't shed, and it's kind of like stiff but like soft at the same time. So you know it'll work good. And then I got the complexion brush, and it's just an all-over face brush, and it's so soft and it doesn't shed either. I had, there were some worries about Elf brushes shedding and these are definitely not one of them. Oh my gosh it smells so good. Oh my goodness. Okay. Right, so next thing I got from the Elf Studio line is the eyeliner shadow stick. And I kind of already opened it so I could swatch it but I didn't completely open it so I could show you the packaging. But um, this is in the this is the purple one. Wow, this is really hard to get out. Okay, so this is the purple one, and then the eyeshadows or the shadow side looks like that, and this is the purple shadow side. What's that? The shadow, which it looks kind of it's a lot darker than I thought it would be, and then this is the liner side, and the liner is in plum, and that's the liner underneath it. So hopefully that'll be pretty. Okay, so the next thing I got was the Complexion Perfect. Like little thing. And it's like um um what a concealer. Yeah. But it's like it looks like this. It has all the colors, you know like the yellow yellow for the under eye and then like the green for the redness uh, but it's in a powder form it's not in like a creamy form like most concealers are so I don't know how much I'm gonna like this but I'm gonna have to I'll probably do a review on that because I don't know and then I bought this so I could do a comparison video and it's the elf contouring blush and bronzer palette and it's comparable supposedly to the NARS Laguna Bronzer and Orgasm Blush set. But this is $3 and that is $40. So that's the blush. That's the bronzer. It actually looks a little bit darker than the Laguna. But I'm going to have to use this for a while and then I'll do a comparison video. And so that's everything I got from the Elf Studio line, and then on the regular line, do you know everything's a dollar? You know, I make up with my hands. I got this brush, which is a blonze, bronzing, bronzing blush. Oh my gosh, all their brushes smell so good. And it looks like this. And I was a little worried because I heard the ones with the red is the ones that shed. But so, like, I took it out in the store, and it doesn't shed, like at all. No hair. But like it feels nice, and it like feels like it like it'll work really good for bronzer. It's contouring bronzer blush. So let's hope that works good. And then next thing I got was this custom compact. That's what the box looks like, and you just pull it out. It says Elf elements on it, and it's just like a little magnetic thingy. And then I bought four eyeshadows to, to go in it. But you don't have to put the e.l.f. eyeshadows in it. You could put your MAC shadows fit in it. And like I know other shadows fit in it. But this color, they come in these little boxes. And this one is what I picked for the highlighting color. Or, and it's pink ice. Wow, I'm having really bad deja vu right now. 
what it looks like. And that's such a pretty highlighting color. I thought so. I just put this in backwards, I think. Oh, well. Okay, so this one is Gold and Glow. I should have just left the one in. It would be faster. So. And the swatch looks like this. Oh, my pinky. It's a really pretty gold color, and I wear a lot of golds because my school colors is black and gold. Um, I wear a lot of grays too. So, so I, this one is a periwinkle, and it's like a medium gray. So I think it works really good for like a um, a crease color. Can you see it? It's under the liner right there. So pretty, and it keeps popping out on me. And then the last color I got was in Moon Dust. I was going to get like this black color, but like, I feel like I have tons of black eyeshadows. So I got this color. Did I see what it is? It's in Moon Dust, if I didn't tell you already. It's like a dark brown almost. And that's what it looks like. It's a really pretty color. I don't have another color like that. Okay. Ugh. Okay, so, and then that's all I got from e.l.f. And then next, you've seen, I've used this in a video before, and it's the Maybelline Mousse Blush. But I got it in another color. This color is, is Soft Plum, and I feel like it's a darker color, so it'll be better for winter. And it looks like this. And there it is. Isn't that so pretty? I love these blushes. They work so well. Oh gosh. And then I've had, I didn't buy this tonight, but I thought I'd show you because it's unopened, so it's kind of like, huh? And it's the Dream Matte Moves Foundation. And it worked really good for my best friend, so let's hope it works really good for me. Okay, so moving on to Ulta, I got two Eco Tool brushes. This is a um, concealer brush. I really like Eco Tool brushes, and like it's small enough to get into like the little places. I don't know why you'd have a pimple on the corner of your eye. And then another eyeshadow brush. And this is just like a bigger one. It'd work really good for your crease, I think. But they're about to go 50% off, so I had to get two, of course. And then next is my new loves. Well, like, I don't know, I haven't tried the hip kind, but I love the Maybelline. Um the Maybelline gel liner so but they only have it in black and brown and I wanted it in colors so I found the hip like L'Oreal hip and I got it in eggplant a pretty purple color and I got it in moonlight blue I'm running out of time Okay, well, it's just this really pretty blue color. I can't get that out. I'm so sorry. Oh, I only have one more thing, don't I? Hmm. Okay, the last thing I got was a NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil. And it's in the color purple. Um, this is blue. People are colorblind. This is not purple. Can you see this? That is not purple. It looks kind of purple. When I do put it on camera. It's not purple. Oh, it's purple on. Oh my goodness, there's a swatch of it. It's definitely purple. Wow, it looks blue. Huh, that's really weird. Um, here, I'm going to swatch these um, cream eyeshadows real fast just because I didn't get to. This is eggplant and it's purple. And it looks like that. And, sorry, I thought I was running out of time, but I didn't. So I'll swatch these real fast. If I can get this one out, I will. Okay. Real fast. This is the Midnight Blue. Ooh, that's so pretty. I'm so glad I got the blue. I almost didn't get the blue. Oh my gosh. Okay, so that's just my haul video. I hope you guys enjoyed it because... I had fun, obviously, shopping. But um, let me know if you guys want me to do any reviews, and I will do them for you. Um, so, yeah, thank you guys. Bye.